everybody, and good morning. Welcome to Gardening with Guy. I'm Guy. I'm your garden guy. I'm going to be there for you. We're going to we're going to set you guys up uh, some, at least maybe not today, but one of these days we're going to get you to get some stuff for your garden that's going to make it just so beautiful. You know, gardening is not supposed to be tough. It's not supposed to be a challenge. It's supposed to be fun. And so we try to bring you lots of cool products here that are going to make that experience a lot more fun for you. One of the things we like to do is we like to hear from you. So we're going to check the uh, official Gardening with Guy mailbox. You see the little mailman left the thing up for me. So let's see what we got today. Hey, look, it's hey a shout out. Thank you, you to all mail. of our friends that joined us on Facebook Live last week. I want to say their names. So we have Janelle, we have Adriana, Lisa, Deanne, Robin, Charlotte. Oh, and one dude, Jeff. <laughs> Thanks, Jeff, for hanging in there. Anyway, we'll put that back in and we'll put our mailbox out. We're going to be checking out from time to time. So anyway, welcome into the show. Uh, we've got something so dang adorable to start our show with. When I saw this, um, I was like, oh my gosh, this is so cool. Um, uh, we love our little garden creatures, right? Because a garden's not a garden without little garden creatures. And one of those creatures happens to be Mr. Squirrel. Well, Mr. Squirrel is going to absolutely love our brand new Wind & Weather Metal Retro Chair. This is the coolest thing of all time. Basically, you just put it on any tree, any log. Look, <laughs> Mr. Squirrel will come and he'll be like, hey, thanks so much. You know, this corn is delicious. Maybe I'll take a little seat. It's only $24.95. It affixes to any tree, any limb or whatever, any branch. It keeps the squirrels where they need to be up there in the trees, right? Then rather than running around your house looking for food. And it is just hours and hours and hours of entertainment. As I said before, it's easy to put in. It's brand new here. And if you want to bring your little buddy to dinner at a safe distance, this is the way to do it. Carrie Mobley, come on out here. Oh my God. My first guest on the show today. This, what is this? Is this our fourth show, you guys? I think it's our fourth show, right? Anyway, we love the fact that you guys are loving the show because, I mean, gardening should be fun. It should be yes. a time to kind of hang out and relax. I'm always surprised when people say like, oh my gosh, I got to get out there. I got to do this in the garden today. It's like, then you're doing it wrong. You should be well, yeah, enjoying it, it's right? It's the pleasure. It, there yeah. is a lot of work involved with it, but when you have something like the wind and weather squirrel feeder, <laughs> there is no work at all, and you're going to get such a pleasure out of this. So it's the retro chair, which should kind of remind you of, you know, your grandmother's chair when you were growing up, her outdoor lawn chair. So that's kind of the look of it. It's a beautiful pop of red. It's powder-coated steel, and it's made by wind and weather, so you know it's going to last for years and years. So basically what you do is you take a couple of nails, and you just hammer it right into a right. tree Won't hurt or the a tree. fence uh, no yeah. absolutely no. not or a fence post and then i i do recommend dried corn and the reason i recommend dried corn is because it's very difficult for the squirrel to take the whole corn cob off we have a nice little screw here and all you do is you take the screw corn on. and you screw it on and what this does is it prevents it from being ripped off all in one fell right. swoop so then he just kind of sits right here and he munches away <laughs> all you're you're gonna love it. Oh it is gosh. so I darn cute. Yeah. I know. And so the thing is, not everybody knows where to get dried corn. I got mine from a feed store. You will have no more fun than you will at a feed store. The people that right. work in these feed stores you are so them. smart. You're surprised. You'd be surprised that you can find them Walmart. all over the place. Yep. If you want to, you can buy some corn at the store and just let it, you know, let it dry out somewhere. You can do that too. But it is available. You can find it all over. Um, or hey, listen, you know, whatever it is you want to put out there, even if it's just, uh, you know, if you want to make your own treat and put it out right. there, as long as you can screw it on there, because you know, a squirrel. They're pretty. They're pretty smart, right? They, they, they will. I mean, I, I, my father spent years and years and years, like trying to figure out how to keep squirrels out of his bird feeder. He tried greasing the pole and and the line. He tried putting foil on all this stuff. And that dang squirrel's so smart. So they will figure this out really quickly. And that's what's nice about screwing the cob down is that they, right. once they realize they can't pull it away, they'll start eating it. And right. it is the most charming thing ever. I mean, look at that. That's yeah, like that's people, like look at that scene right there. People love squirrels. You know, they've got those big bushy tails and the way they just take the food and put it up to their mouth There's almost like human characteristics about yeah. it now I will tell you that if you have a hard time finding dried corn, which you won't I mean it really is easy to find that's really but it, on there too by the way It is very much on there. You it, can't get screw. it off. It's not yep. a nail So you screw that in and then you know, mr. Squirrel will come, you know first he'll run around it You know how squirrels do that and by the way this this is a very heavy-duty metal chair This is not like cheapo plastic 24.95 is a great price for it. This is really Really it is. Well, it's wind and weather, so you know right. you're going to get quality. They've right. been around since 1976, and their pieces have stood the test of time. So um, what I was going to say, though, is you can also use an apple, um, and I have an apple here. Now, you can screw it in as well, but just so you know, though, the squirrel is going to try really hard to take it with him 
permanently, right. which is kind of fun too. To I mean, watch. can you imagine like walking outside Squirrels and seeing this watch, squirrel no matter what. try They're to hilarious. pull this? They are hysterical. I know. I know. But the idea is it gives something fun in your outdoor space. It's just precious. And of course you are, you're helping the environment by inviting nature into your property. Even if you don't have a tree, you can put it on like, this is a log that I had I had an incident at my house. The sure. recycling truck smashed yeah, into one the of yard. them. <clears throat> exactly. You can sure. just take a log, even if you get one that you would put in your fireplace and nail it into it. Or even, as you can see back here, on a fence post. So the yeah. options are really limitless. You can come and see it in the car. There it is. Thanks, Mike. So look at, we just put it on a post, and it's a great way. And you know, I, I like we said, squirrels are really, really smart. What I like about this is it gives them an area that's not too close to your to your house. Because you know, squirrels are easy to train. And, and I know my dad used to try to throw them crackers and stuff. And, you know, you're still dealing with a creature, a, creature, a wild right, animal. Right. So this is great, and the kids will enjoy it. So if you have a picture window or something like that where you want to be able to view the live action as it's happening, these are the little things that makes your property and your garden different. Little fun little things that involve the animals. By the way, I have a humming, I have the uh, the hummingbird um, um, plant coming up later. Oh. Um, I'm going to feed my birds in a sec. But it's all about not just what you plant, but how you decorate uh, your space, too. So, all right, if you'd like this, I mean, it looks like a little mini retro chair it's from the so 70s. Adorable. It's pretty cool. It is uh, only $24.95, 643-964 if you want to remember the item number if you're waiting for the end of the show to do all your ordering. So anyway, we love it. Great job. Oh, Thanks so, so much. Fun. That's a lot of fun. Thank I, can't, you. I, yep. I would love to have one of those in my I'll yard. I'll get you one. Yes. Right, give me one. I'm going to go feed some birds. Where's my bird feeder? It's behind me. So come on back. We'll walk back and feed. You hear them? I, can, I, I don't see them, but I, I hear them. So anyway, let's feed the birds. Again, you know, you fed the squirrels. You don't want the birds out there being like, yo, bro, what about us? Where, where's our food? So anyway, get a bird feeder. It'll help to bring all the beautiful birds to your property. All right, there we go. All right, birds, can you hear it? Birds, they're coming. <laughs> hey, still to come uh, in just a bit, and this is one of my favorite items all time for outdoors. It's the shimmering chandelier. It's called Shimmer Falls. Let me tell you, this thing is absolutely gorgeous. If you want to decorate an outdoor space, and it could be in a garden, but it could be on your patio. This can go indoors or outdoors. It is beautiful. It's not just a beautiful crystal hanging chandelier. It actually illuminates. It lights up as well. It has a built-in timer, automatically shuts off after five hours. I have either silver or I have the gold today. They are on FlexPay. This sold out last year. We just got them back in. Look at how beautiful this is. If you're entertaining for an outdoor space on a Decker patio, this thing is gorgeous. That's coming up a little bit later. If you'd like to go ahead and pre-order it, we have them back in stock um, at only $39.9. Hey, you know what time it is? Let's get what time it is. It's grow time. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. All right, so we're, now we will talk about plants and flowers. Uh, we have Rochelle Greyer with, uh, with us. It's good to see you again, my you dear. Too. Thanks so much for coming. Uh, you've been in all our shows, and we have been, we, I, I'm so excited in, uh, that we've been so successful in getting people to climb on board and start too. ordering their flowers now. Now, uh, this uh, Leaf and Petal, if you don't know, th this is a, a group of folks that actually hand select and hand pick and curate the best flowers from all over the country. This is not what you get at the home store. Home store is picked over. The home store plants sit there for a long time. You never know how old they are. These are all gonna come freshly delivered to your house when it's time for them to be planted in your area. How do we know that? Well, we have a map of the country. And remember, you're not paying for these yet. You only pay when they ship. So if you live in the northern half of the country, you're <laughs> gonna be getting your things more towards uh, middle of April and early May. If you live in the southern half of the, car, of the country, you're gonna get them now and in the next couple of weeks. But you don't pay until they go in the mailbox. So all you're doing is making sure that you secure your amazing design. And again, all curated from the best growers out there in the country. Um, you are a landscape designer amongst yep. many other things. So you're the, you're the go-to person when it comes to, uh, to wonderful plants. This we had on one time before, it went crazy. Yep. Why? Because if you love butterflies. Butterflies, or birdies, hummingbirds. hummingbirds. We call this hummingbird mint. This yeah. is an amazing selection. It's the three-piece butterfly plant, plant. set. Um, so uh, you will absolutely love these. They are, they, they have these, they're bursting with color. They are. You get all three varieties, all three colors. All three colors. And, um, and it's, I mean, I just think it's wonderful. They're, and they can yeah. go anywhere, right? Borders, They can go anywhere. Pots. You don't really want to put these in shade. These are definitely right. sunshine. hot sunshine. Uh, sort of places they can go in part shade it's not a big deal if you do them in part shade but uh, they are something that it's gonna be really easy to take care of because they don't need a lot of water they're actually a really good plant for like a xeric landscape a xeric landscape is a drought wise kind of landscape someplace where you don't necessarily uh, have a sprinkler running all the time right so 
Um, the other thing though, this is my favorite part about these. These are amazing because they smell so good. Yeah. And that's what draws in the, all, the, all the bugs and the birds and all that. But honestly, like this is, you have to smell this. I mean, this. Now that's the that's the greenery. That's the it greenery. It smells it's, like 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 thyme or rosemary. It it's smells kind herby. Of like a cross, yeah, it's very herby. It's like yeah. a cross between like rosemary and mint. I mean, yeah. to me, it smells like my favorite spa. Like it's just that oh, it's sort so of nice. like. Right. This could be an oil that right. Yeah, at a like massage place. you know exactly like it's the wonderful. most calming, relaxing, beautiful thing. And the, when they're in the heat, that just that smell, just kind of that oil that makes that uh, heats up in the heat, and it just kind of emanates off. And so like if you you're walking next to it, you're gonna smell it. If you have it around your patio, yeah. you're gonna smell it. It's just this very calming kind of Oh, like breath of fresh air kind of smell. Hey, these are our flowers are being delivered on free shipping and handling again. And remember, uh, you're just ordering now. They're going to come to your door when it's time for you to either plant them or put them out and, and enjoy them. Um, when you get them, because um, it takes a you know a few weeks for them to sort of come into yeah. full full bloom. This is what they will this look like. This is what they look like. Yeah. So you're going to get three of these. They'll each be labeled with what they are. So you're going to get one of the uh, violet, one of the, we call this blue. It's really more a little purple yeah. and then the orange. Uh, and so you'll get one of each. I mean, to be honest, as a landscape designer, I like to actually plant things in threes. So if you like these three colors, yeah. you can plant them all three together. But I personally, I would probably buy three of these sets and I would group three oranges together, three blues, three violets. Sure. Just because you get to see that even bigger pop of color in the landscape if you have a little space. This is really if you have a little space. Yeah. But um, this is how they'll come. And this, this is a representation. They're gonna grow to be mostly this size. This is more second year, but they'll get pretty big in that first year and you really will have this beautiful display. Um, the other thing I want to tell you about that's really special about these, if you've grown this plant before, other older varieties, they get much taller and the blooms are kind of up with the leaves. These are a new breeding. This is what's really special about leaf and petal is we're going out there as professionals and we are really cherry picking like the best and most right. interesting stuff. So what's interesting about these is the uh, hummingbird mint that you might know, they're bigger plants. Those blooms are kind of in with the leaves. Whereas this one, these ones are low. They're much more compact. They're a little, they're denser. So you get kind of more of this foliage and then flowers. I like the spikes of flowers. The spikes of flowers yeah. are really nice. You see them more and they're really more prominent and more distinctive. So, um, and they're a little smaller. So if you um, have a container garden or a patio or smaller area, that'll really work for you as well. I love the blend of all three. You know what, you yeah. know what this, this does to me? This, this sends me like on a total flower trip. You know, know what I mean? I know. They're so, like they're, these colors are they, pretty groovy, yeah? <laughs> I, I just want to use that. I enjoy that. All right. If you love butterflies, well, well here's the thing, too, with, with especially with butterflies and hummingbirds. People are like, I never see them. You have to give them stuff you so that they'll come. Yeah. You have to invite them into like, your home. Like nobody's coming to your house if and, you don't give them a cocktail. Right, and yeah. let me tell you, when you walk by somebody's property and you see butterflies or you see uh, hummingbirds, you're just like, oh my gosh, what do they know that I don't? They're feeding them. Can I tell you, yeah. yesterday afternoon I went to the Florida Botanic Garden. They have a butterfly garden and then they also have a ton of other gardens. Right. I mean, it was ridiculous. In that butterfly <laughs> garden, there was hundreds of butterflies and there were no butterflies anywhere else. Anywhere else. I mean, it, all these butterfly plants, yeah. they really do work. It was shocking. They, they have that it, when, when you go to Universal here. Universal yeah. Studios at one of the uh, on the offshoots of the park near a hotel. There's a butterfly garden, and I always, when I go on my walk, I always there's a way to go around it. I'm like, why would you go why around would you it? Why would you go around you it? You go yeah. through it, and there are butterflies, there are butterflies everywhere. everywhere, and they land on you, if and they're really. You, if yeah. you love butterflies, and you love, and now we haven't even really hit on. Oh, you talked about a little hummingbirds. bit about the fragrance of this, and, yeah. and how they will draw not just uh, butterflies, but hummingbirds, hummingbirds. and love honeybees these. as well. Um, I love the right. fat bees. We have a we have a question from Dawn. Yep. And. Uh, she wants to know how big these will get. So these, this is a good indication of the size of the, right here. Of the so maximum. you're gonna get tops two feet, really kind of more on the 18 inch yeah. um, sort of range, which is really different than other uh, traditional ag agastache. That's that's this plant, hummingbird yeah. mint, these are different names for it, yep. that can get upwards of three or four feet tall. So these ones are very compact yeah. and really give Look that pow of color. Well, I mean, and, the and blues again, are so big. I love them because versus like, you know, a tulip or a rose and things like that, which, you know, you get the one blossom. Sometimes you get little yeah. clumps. This is all blossoms. These are all blossoms and these yeah. are going to really last you all season. That's part of our, what we look for in our breeding uh, at Leaf and Petal. We want 
want stuff that's going to last all season, be super easy yeah. to grow. And really, I mean, honestly, we want to make any gardener, even if you've never gardener, just feel so successful and like, you, know, you got this. Yeah. It, we got you. We, yeah. We, we, we try to bring you things that are not really hard to grow either. Yeah. I mean, that's part of curating the product because if they're really tough to grow, then most people are not going to yeah. get them to grow. We These are for everybody. Easy hey, really and quick, lots Aaron, of Aaron, can you put the map up one more time? Yeah. I just want to make sure everybody understands. So I, a lot of you are like, well, it's too early to plant. No, no, no. Here's what happens. You order now and you make sure you get the best plants, not the picked over ones from the home store, the best plants. They'll come to your door when it's time for you to plant. Yes. If you live in the Dakotas, for instance, or if you live in Florida or California right now, you're going to get yours when you need to get them. So if you were in the southern half where it's mostly green, you're going to be getting them right now yes. because we are in, obviously, you know, into, uh, into that time of season. If you are way, way up at the tip top, then you're going to wait probably till mid-April, a little bit later in April. But that's what you want to do. You don't want to put these in, things no. in too early because they won't survive. So we take the guesswork out. But let's talk about that surviving thing. These are perennials. These are going to come back for you year in and year out. And they're going to get bigger and better every year. But here's the thing. If they don't, right here, you're going to get this brochure in the mail when your plants arrive. Uh -huh. This brochure, not only does it tell you everything, and oh, this one got a little wet, everything you need to know to take care of it and how to uh, plant it and all of that. But right here on the back is all of our contact information at Leaf and Petal. And you okay. can call us up. Talk to us about yeah. any problems you're having. We'll help you out. But if they don't come back, if they fail, we will replace them. These have a one-year warranty. Really quick, we have Alicia that, that just is uh, on Facebook. She wants to know how uh, if they will bloom all season or what they're blooming. They will bloom all is. season. As soon as they start blooming, they'll bloom right through over the fall. And over, over and over and over. And also, these dry really well. Yeah. So that even if you, like, you know, at the end of the season when things yeah. start to crispy up, they're still going to look really pretty. All right. I want to remind everybody, we are continuing on with the show. We invite your comments on Facebook, so please go to our Facebook page. Hey, come up at the end of the show, Peter Kilcullen is joining us and he's got something brand new. I don't know if we've ever done this combo before, but it's brilliant. For anybody who wants to manicure their garden, it is the chainsaw hedge trimmer combo. I mean, why buy two different tools when you can get it all in one? It actually, the powerized uh, motor uh, uh, part of, the, of this uh, device will click into a chainsaw uh, connection that we give you and then it also comes with the hedge trimmer connection as well so it is a true two-in-one it's only $119.95 look at how cool that is right um, so it just does double duty it's on flex pay of only $23.99 we're going to show you all the great ways that you can get your property in order because it is springtime come on it feels like spring here and I know springtime is coming to you um, so let's continue on with more wonderful flowers so we try to do at least two flower um, sets in each show uh, and we're going to talk about the hibiscus and Man, I, you know, I've lived all over the country. I've been to Hawaii where they grow wild everywhere. Um, but I've lived in Arizona where, where I've, I've had them out there as well. They're here in Florida. But you'll be surprised. Hibiscus can grow pretty well anywhere if you yeah. know how to take care of them and you know what to do with them. And we're going to take all the guesswork out. These have massive pink and white blossoms, as you can see right there. They're well branched, yet they're pretty compact. So if you want to use them, uh, you know, on, uh, as borders, you want to use them as in an entryway. Um, they deliver flowers year after year after year. They're wonderful in a container. Oh, they like, are. These so are great. If you want to put them on a deck or patio, they're fantastic. Yes. So yes. anyway, they're only $23.95. And again, we'll deliver them and you won't pay for them until they get shipped, so, depending on where you live in the country. Yeah. But look at how pretty these oh, are. Oh, these are so gorgeous. I love, so these are really what you're getting is they're two in every pot. In every pot. So when you get it in the mail, you're going to get something like this. You get two pots and in each pot you're getting multiple plants you don't want to separate those out we've grown those together for a reason so that you get these beautiful two-tone flowers you get the darker pink and the lighter pink which I, I mean they're just so beautiful these are huge they have like they're about a good age i mean these are as big as my hand yeah um, and i've you know no they are they are like right. eight, eight inches look at the size of the yeah, flowers they're enormous wow. so the other thing that's really nice about these is that these die right back a lot of people um with, that are familiar with hibiscus or related plants is especially up north you have these kind of naked branch structures sure. all winter yeah. it's not terrible but this the, what's nice about these they die right back and literally all this <laughs> beautiful foliage you know, comes back every year which to me that's the main thing about totally, gardening yeah. like in March you have nothing and by June you have a jungle you're, like, you're, yeah you're I mean loaded. it's just like how fun is that well, like watching all this stuff and, just pop and, up and grow and look at these you're not going to find stuff like this in the home store okay you're not going to find results like this I mean you're it's a gamble every time you yeah. go you don't know where you don't know where the plants came from you don't know how long they've been sitting there you don't know if they've got any issues with the roots or if there's insects in them all these when you when you grab them are going to be in par when you get them are going to be in perfect shape and ready to go so uh, in a matter of weeks you're going to start to see the flowers yeah. and then you're like oh my gosh now you mentioned um, planting them together 
Yeah, so, well, you can plant them together, so you can actually make, I mean, look at the mass of this. This is yeah, literally so like six do... feet by, you know, two or three feet. These yeah. are gonna get about uh, two to three feet tall and the same wide. So these make excellent kind of very stately container plantings like we have them here. Or you can uh, buy a few sets, because you're, you know, yeah. imagine if you had uh, four or six, that's either buying two or three sets of these. Suddenly you can have hedges, you can, you know, have all kinds yeah. of, I mean, you really I, can make a big statement with I would this. put them, I would even put them, like, if you have a front porch and you want to put, like, flank, flank the porch. Flank the porch. That, you know what that would be? Flank the walkway. Be a blooming good idea. That's what that would be. <laughs> Hello. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, you know what else is a blooming good idea, Love though? that. This is what I want to show you. Oh, put those out, too. Look how beautiful all of these things go together. I mean, if you, you love pink help? and purple. Sure. <laughs> you hold this one. Look like, at, look at this. I mean, yeah. uh, who doesn't love this color? Like, the, I mean, I would put these down in front. So if, if, if you're around your patio or something, or around the front of your house, or an, a, around a walkway, put, put right these there. shorter ones out front, and they're going to look just so beautiful. Got it. Right here in front Shall of this hibiscus. Like, look at that color. Yeah. I mean, these And, and remember, textures. those are that's our, our butterfly uh, plant set. That's still available. You get yeah. one more of these. You actually get three of those if you want to continue to order that. But I want you to show... I want to show everybody, look at this, and this isn't even everything you get. If you if you bought both flowers today, this is that's forty eight dollars, right? Do you don't do you think that that display is worth I mean, forty eight dollars? That is, that is worth hundreds thing. of dollars. You know, and we get, they'll both come back. They're and, both pretty right, right, right. And you get them year after year. Oh, year after year. All right. So Lisa wants to know, what does she want to know? Sun, oh, sunny or shady for hibiscus. I'm thinking probably sunny. So both sunny. of these are uh, full sun to part sun. So okay. you're going to want the same uh, growing environment for both of these. The one thing about this is that these uh, don't need as much water. These ones need a bit more water. They're going to want, these aren't going to struggle if you give them more water, but these yeah. kind of will want them. Well, so these are going to be more full and they're they, going to require. They just, they, yeah, they yeah. like that moisture soil, um, whereas those are a bit more uh, tolerant of yeah. everything. So These, again, are free shipping. Everything that we're doing in plants is free shipping and handling. And we're gonna remember we're gonna we'll put the map up one more time I know I kind of like beating the dead horse here but I want to show you and I want you to know if you're gonna get these in three weeks because that's the time they need to be delivered to your house for depending where you live you don't pay for them until they go in the mail so right now you're just pre-ordering and you're selecting what you want what I love too is that all of a sudden like in two and a half three weeks or four weeks whatever is your growing time there's a knock on the door and you've got something alive that I comes know. to your house and is ready to go in the ground. And, and once you get it either in the ground or in a pot, you get to take care of it, but it's so much easier than kids. <laughs> you know what I mean? Is, because, I mean, you know I mean I, even though you have to feed them, but, but once you get them going, they give back so they much. They give back. Well, and the, you know, the thing is, is I was saying to somebody yesterday, I'm like, this, how fun is this? Like, they are kind of like kids. Like, I, I love taking baby pictures of my plants. Yeah. Because honestly, it's so hard to believe that in a few short months, you're gonna have something like this. And looking back at that before and after, yeah. like that is the true joy of gardening. The tomato plant? Yeah. You should see my tomato plant. We, you know, uh, Aaron, we gotta weeks, get more right? pictures. Yeah. Of, we gotta have to get updated pictures of my plants. So good. My tomato plants, which are this big, are that big. Yeah. And what is that, two weeks ago? Yeah. It's it's so much fun to watch. It is. And all I've done is add a little water to them. Actually, I put yeah. some spring grow on them too. Gardening just is I not have that it. hard. It, it just is it, not that hard. If gardening is really, really People hard. People freaked out. It's not hard. Then you're yeah. not doing it right. Yeah. Okay? It's not that Don't hard. overwhelm yourself. Don't plan more than you can handle. No. Keep it it's easy. It's just, again, like kids, you know? Trust I mean, us. It's this easy is, to handle a couple of kids. You got 10 of them. Well, sorry, you got what you paid for. But, you know, it is. And remember that leaf and petal brings you things that are much easier to grow. It's that. like, you know, when you go to the home store, there's everything under the rainbow. Half that stuff is gonna be hard to grow. Half that stuff well, is gonna is take a to lot grow. of Plus, work. Plus, on top of that, different varieties of things, you just never quite know. Like, we're, we're actually, we are really are cherry picking the things and really putting yeah. things together to make that designer look, but also that is gonna absolutely guarantee your success. Okay, $23.95 if you'd like to get this. Don't forget, we also had the butterfly plant, hummingbird plant earlier if you'd like to get that. Rochelle, great job again. Thank you. Can't Thank wait to you. see you again next week. Week I know, well, on our next show. So yeah. uh, continue to order in. I want to remind everybody coming up in just a bit do you have a part of your property that you wish you could just kind of hide? You know, maybe it's just an awful fence or maybe it's your recycle bins or your trash bins. Well, we have the expandable faux ivy privacy fence coming up. This sold out almost every time we brought it up last year. Watch the transition. Look at that, the transformation, I should say. Look at how beautiful it is, except this is the jumbo size. This is the largest one that we have. You can do it like ivy crawling up the side of a wall. You can put it along a rail, a railing or, or a fence. You can put it, um, you can really put it anywhere. We even have it on our lanai. We have it over our heads. Um, you can put this thing anywhere and it is really cool. And this year, we actually have different uh, color accent leaves on it too. It's great for uh, around a pool, a pool fence, but look at how awful that looks. 
And then look at how great that looks, right? So tidy. Uh, you never have to water it. It's forever permanent. Um, yeah, disappearing, uh, uh, you know, um, pool stuff too. I love that. All right, that's only 29.16. That's coming up a little bit. So um, every show I have what I call my pick of the show. Last year sold out every single time that we had it. That's why we made it this year, my pick. That out. A little sound effect. All right, so these are absolutely gorgeous. I, I can't get over that we only do these at thirty nine ninety five because they they look like a like a hundred dollar item and they act like it and they are beautiful. It's called Anywhere Lighting. It's an absolutely stunning di display. Today we have it in what we're calling the silver, or the gold, or I would actually call this more of a copper color. And I think Linda Lyday would agree with me. Right, yeah. It's got more of a copper tone. So, but anyway, welcome to the show. Good morning. This um, pretty much sold out every time we brought it in last year. Yeah. It is so beautiful, and because it's a lot more than just what you see. It is these beautiful crystals, okay, and they're all displayed in the beautiful draping sort of a cascading color. They are, they make a little bit of a, a soft sort of a like twinkling noise when they bounce into yep. each other, but this also is illuminated. So at night, you can turn it on and it has a, a five hour um, display time that automatically turns off and this thing just sparkles and absolutely glows. I wanna kind of move them a little bit so you can see how pretty they are. $39.95, it's only $19.98. This is the kind of thing that m can make like a patio or a garden just totally be transformed, right? This, yeah, I mean, this is the jewelry for your yeah, patio, yeah. isn't it? And the, the great thing about this is that, well, well, you see how pretty it is. Looks like a piece of jewelry. I, I was looking at it going, oh my gosh, it looks like somebody put really a bunch of necklaces on yeah. because it's that pretty. It also has these faceted acrylic crystals, so they catch the light. And in the sun and in the daytime, it just gives that splash of elegance elegance yeah. to wherever you're going to put it. And the thing that's nice is that you can put it anywhere. Why? Because it takes no, nothing except literally a hook yeah. to hang it, right? It comes in the oh, box yeah. and you just open it up and you pull it up and it's ready to go. It literally. Comes with the chain, look. Just like this, okay? <laughs> it comes with the chain. Now let's go with, you know, let's talk about the light because the yeah. light that goes in here is right here and it just drops in. Now, yeah. you're going to have to put three AA batteries in here. Okay. But I want to explain something to you. You have two different features here. You have the white LED that just looks beautiful and elegant. Right. But if you want to get kind of crazy, it has the color changing Love that. LED. We're having a party is, or something. Yes, because sure. it goes yeah. to red, it goes to green, and it just slowly goes in. Now, what I want you also to know is that there's a timer built into here, guy. So the moment that if you want this to turn on at 6 p.m., let's say, yeah. that's when you put the battery batteries in and then you just leave it and forget it and every and it will go on for five hours right. and every night at 6 p.m. it'll go on for five hours and automatically shut off so I love that yeah no all babysitting you, I love that too right no babysitting you just put it in like that and now all I have to do is I hit the light and there I have my light on yeah. now if I wanted to do changing the color changing light I put it here and you can see it just goes through and all the, and the different colors and that actually colors. opens up inside the cast cascading uh, crystals and mm -hmm. by the way this is made of little mirrors and little crystals and you can see them in our in our footage here um, we have a cloudy day here so we're not getting as much sparkle as we normally do but I wanted to show you this to show you those are little tiny mirrored panels and those are actual little crystals that reflect light and sparkle um, you get so much bang for your buck out of this thing and again you know what I love there's no cords there's no wires, you, so you can put it virtually anywhere. And by the way, it's not solar powered. This is regular battery power. So if you wanna put this inside and hang it inside on your screen porch, or if you wanna put it on a patio, Right. Or if you want to move it from place to place, you can do it uh, as well. So look at how gorgeous exactly. it is. Exactly. This, this is what's so nice. And yeah. look at it hanging up. Now, that's just, this is what's really nice about this, too, because imagine being able to have that decor that you can usually get on the inside of your home, imagine having it on the outside of your home. And look how pretty that's it, that is. Now imagine the wind wow. taking through that. <laughs> right, Guy? It's imagine beautiful. That. So in the daytime, you're getting the shimmer. And at nighttime, not only do you get the shimmer, but you have it eliminated with that LED, yeah. that beautiful LED. And then the LED or the color changing comes right here. Now this drops right in there, and that's what's going to give you your light. 
right. And again, the moment you put your batteries in, that's when it kicks off. So if you want it to start at 6 or 7 p.m., you can have a five-hour timer automatically, but you put the batteries in. And guess what? If you forget all that, you have the instructions. It comes with it. But this is how it comes out of the box. All you have to do, you literally lift it up and you hang it. That's all like you do. That. All right. Silver is the most popular right now, although I pretty much I like the copper I, I'm surprised because I think the copper color yes. even though it says gold it, it that's just how you order but look at how pretty hey listen if you want to get two I'm not going to be uh, mad at you you get whatever you want um on our Facebook page who do we have Marianne and she owns the, she bought the silver last year and Marianne says she loves it she thinks it's beautiful. You know something, what I love? Where have you ever seen anything like this? This is the only place I've seen that is here at HSN. Yeah. And I find that these, first of all, I think it has this almost like a little bit of retro look to it. It does. It's right? very modern looking. Yeah. Yeah, it has yeah. a very it nice It could go modern. either way, right? Yeah. It could be like, like I would totally see this in like a 70s pad. Right. Totally. But at the same time, you know, with all the new features and everything like that, and being able, in the 70s, there's no way you'd have an automatic turn off, turn on switch to it. It wouldn't have um, the multicolor right because that's all new color change is all something that's just recent you know the last 10 years or so having right. things that morph into different colors so it's got all these great modern features but it's so easy to hang here's i'm going to give you a fair warning on this because i know this from last year and marianne knows this too this sells out every time and then we have a really hard time getting them back so if you would like it or if you want to buy one for a friend, maybe you have somebody that just moved into an apartment, uh, you want to get somebody a nice housewarming gift, or you want to take your property to the next level. I tell you, when people come to your house, yes. everybody that, let's say you're having a party, right. everyone that comes to that party will ask about this. Yeah, every you, single one. You know what I love about this? Wow. Those of you who love to go glamping, Imagine bringing this to a picnic. Imagine bringing this to camping because you can. Oh, is that what glamp? What is glamping? Glamping. It's glamorous, glamorous camping. Glamorous camping. Yeah, because you I know that's when you want to be comfortable and you look fabulous yeah, too. Yeah, I'm right? not sleeping on the floor in a tent. Let's yeah, just put it that exactly. way. I'm gonna I can get myself up. <laughs> then off the you floor. like to go glamping. I do. But you can do that. You can hang you it from a bring, tree. You can do. Yes, yeah. exactly. You could put a string in between two trees high up and then hang this down over the picnic table. And let me tell you, it's that kind of thing when you are doing any kind of entertaining and you have people over it's the lighting right it's that special lighting that you can have and now you can bring it anywhere you don't have to run any kind of wires you literally just have your led light here and in the daytime it just gives it that splash of decor yeah. That inside decor that you might have that now you can put it on and the And remember, outside. it lights up. It has a five-hour timer. So this this will all glow from underneath. And as it sparkles, you're going to get to see it. So it's really the show during the day is pretty. Right. The show at night is just as pretty. Right. Right. Even if you have some outdoor accent lighting, all these little mirrors yes. are going to catch the reflection of all your outside lighting. So that makes it really, really nice. Remember, hanging it is literally taking it out of the box. If I can get this off here. You Take it out of the box. It'll be all collapsed mm -hmm. like that. You simply open it up, put it on, put the batteries in if you want to use it at nighttime, which you will, and then hit the switch, and then it'll it'll stay illuminated for five hours. And remember what I love about LED, which this is, they last forever. The batteries will last you a good long time, so you won't be changing the batteries every week. They'll last you months and months and months, and it'll be worth your while to get this. So uh, we only have about a minute left. We might go a little bit longer. Uh, we have a lot of people that are that are chiming in on this literally at the last second here, but I, I, I hope you don't get shut out. I know it sells out every year, um, but if you want to get it, it's only $19.98 on a flex pay. Get it home, hang it up, try it for a month. If you don't love it, um, well, you know, we have our 30-day. Our um, if you're not satisfied, you can always uh, pack it up and send it back. But That's I don't right. think you will. That's <laughs> right. So when you get it out of the box, you're going to put your batteries inside of it. You put it in the back of the... Literally, you have this little round disc, and you're going to unscrew the little screws. Just easy, unscrew it here. And you have these screws here, and then you put your batteries in, okay? And now you have the option. You can have the color changing, which you're seeing here. And I'm gonna flip this over, see this? You can either do the white or the color changing. I can go to the white, and that gives yeah. it that nice white. And this is so pretty, because the way this literally will bounce off all of your, these are faceted acrylic 
crystals. And so when the light hits it, whether it's the sun or this light in the nighttime, between all these pretty little mirrors and the crystals, it just looks fantastic. It does. It's elegant. All right, all you need to decide is which you'd like. If you want to get one of each, I have no issue, uh, but the silver will be the first to sell out if you would like that. Um, everything that you need, just pop it in, grab the batteries that you can grab at any store, pop them in and you're good to go. Just remember to hit that little button uh, and you decide which color you want. Uh, 644926 is the item number. If you would love to get it, we'll ship it out to you. Have it in about a week or so. Linda, great job. Thank you. I love this item. Uh, beautiful. It, it's, it's so much better. And when you get it in person, it's even better. Oh yeah, you're gonna love so, it. So you'll be happy that you purchased this. Uh, 644 again, 926. Hey, I think it's time again to check our mail. Thank you, Linda. Hey Thank you. I will step You've behind got you. mail. I've got mail. That's fantastic. Yeah, see the little things up. All right, let's <laughs> check who we got now. Remember, we're streaming live on Facebook. Oh, it goes the other way. Duh. Maybe first time with a mailbox guy. Okay. Uh, so we want to say a shout out to all our friends that are shopping with us. Let's say hi to Lisa. We'll say hi to Marianne. Would you guys grab me those cards too? Debbie, Deanne. Thanks, Linda. All right. We also have Alicia, Dawn. Uh, that's either Marla or Maria. It's Maria. Uh, we have Diane and who's NQ? NQ. Didn't want to give NQ. She loves the show. Thanks, NQ. And thanks for all of you for uh, shopping with us today and, and joining us on Facebook. Um, all right, we're going to move right into our next item. And I will tell you, this also was extremely popular last year. Why? Well, you know, and I'm not saying that you have something to hide, but maybe you do. Maybe you got something you're not real proud of in your property and you're like, you know, I wish I could just hide that dang thing. Or maybe I just want some great sort of backdrop accenting for my property. Well, uh, the expandable privacy fence uh, last year sold out so quickly. We even thought, we, uh, did, did we ever make it a, 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 like a host pick or a, I mean, everybody wanted this dang thing. So um, with good reason, because you can add it to any situation and you can completely Make it private. So if it's uh, you know your your pool filter and all that stuff, or, or your pool uh, motor um, and all that stuff, you want to hide that. You can do that. If you have garbage cans that you want to get rid of, maybe you're just looking for privacy between you and your neighbor, and you want to get a couple of these. The price out of the gate is ridiculous because we normally get forty dollars for this, and it's only twenty nine sixteen. We're going to show you how how big it is. We're going to show you that we have different colors as well, different accent colors. So this year, instead of just green, and if you come in close, you'll see that's purple, has little accents of purple, which gives it a more real look. Um, it also has flecks of yellow, and it also has the one that's orange, and you're seeing the orange one right there. Rebecca Wood, come on out here. Where's Rebecca? <laughs> Where is she? I don't even know if Rebecca's Can you see here. Me? Yes, there she is. <laughs> Hi, darling. Isn't this amazing? This thing is awesome. You know what I, I love, and you're showing it right now, is that it's adaptable too, it to is. any size, any, any size. space. Look at this. So it goes 11 oh feet gosh. high or 11 feet long and anywhere in between. That's Bigger what I love. Bigger than the one we had last my, year. Yes, yeah. it's almost double the size. Don't you love that? It's you know, so great. What's funny about that last year, out of all the things my mother shops all the time, she kept asking me about this every time. She'd be like, that fence thing that you sold, I, we need that fence thing because we have those big, ugly air conditioner condensers. That's why everybody has something wanna, to hide. we want to hide those stupid things. We all have something yeah. to hide, now, whether it's air conditioning, cracked stucco. Let me ask what? you quickly, when you yes. order it, is there any assembly or anything no, like that? No, it's literally going to come to you just like this. Okay. You just take, it has a little tie around it. You take the tie off and it comes with uh, 11 zip ties, 12 zip ties. Okay. So you can affix it to any kind of fence, any kind of existing, um, structure that you want to try to hide or make more beautiful. Otherwise, you could also just use a nail. I've had mine out for over a year. Yeah. Still gorgeous because this is why it's so special. This is real willow that we use. Real willow and gorgeous faux ivy yeah, leaves. Not, right. This is the very first time ever we have color. So whether it's the purple, whether it's the bright, beautiful orange or the gorgeous yellow here, you're gonna get that pop of color. They've all been pre-treated. You know what I so love about this gorgeous. is this is not plastic. Last year, I don't know if it was it real willow last year too? Um, I, I think can't so. remember. I think it I, was. Well, anyway. The nice thing about it is, is that this is real wood back here too. So that just makes so it a little, at, yeah, you, know, look you at don't this. want some cheapo looking thing. Look, look how, at how pretty great the that back looks. is. Yeah. So this is the front. This is the back. The back is just as pretty as the front. So if you're using this, maybe you live in a condo or an apartment and you have that one balcony that you want to try to get a little bit of privacy. Sure. It's beautiful on both sides. Let me show you some of the ways that you can use it. So there's an obvious thing. You move into a property and it has a chain link fence, which in and of itself are pretty ugly, right? Or maybe you've got traffic and you don't want to look at cars while you're sitting out in your garden, right? Now that's not bad. Like that's beautiful, but still, I think that's even better because you still want some privacy. Not only that, 
if you had that regular uh, wood fence, little critters can get in there as well. This kind of helps to protect it you does, from that too right. because little skunks and various possums and things like that, which you don't need walking and crawling around your deck at night. They'll be kept out too. Look at how hideous that is. Is it ugly? Oh, look at how beautiful. <laughs> you know what I'm doing and right now? And it's so simple because you don't ever have to water it. Wow. You don't have to ever trim it down. I mean, if you wanted to ever hide this, you're going to have to go to a big box store. You're going to have to ask for, uh, to get the trellis yeah. or to get the the structure to be able to plant ivy, wait for it to grow. Then you have to trim it back and maintain it. And do you know what ivy does to your house, to the stucco and the siding? It takes over, man. Oh, it takes over and it yeah. can do so much damage here. There's never any damage. If it ever gets dirty, low pressure water, let it air yeah. dry, you're good to go. But Wash look at it, it off. So many people have fences like this, right? Would you rather look at a chain link fence like this or that? Look how simple that is to do. It is simply zip tying, putting it together. Up to so 11 cool. feet mm -hmm. tall or low. You know what this has got me doing right now, Rebecca? Doing arm it's workout? Got me, no, it's got me <laughs> thinking, thinking green thoughts right oh, now. Oh, yes. You like that, don't you, Pete? <laughs> I think that was the best one. Don't you guys think? Nah, yeah. Look at this, though. So if you're sick of me, Oh, look, I'm gone, right? <laughs> so anything that you want to get rid of, I mean, I, I think like about here, it. Like here, look at this yeah. right here. Oh, so yeah. many times Oh, I like that as like a border. Yes. Look at so many. Look at how low it will go. And so many times, you know, behind your, underneath your deck, you're just seeing the dirt. How much prettier is this? Look at yeah. how low that will go. And you just put it right there, and instead you're looking at a gorgeous green um, edging, I, just like that. That is really cool what you do. In fact, I think that's probably going to become a permanent part uh, of our set I right love there. it. I think it's so Look pretty. Look how nice. But and if you wanted to go tall, yeah. then you just... Go tall. Well, and anything that you want to get rid of. I mean, I wouldn't, this is a potting bench, but if you wanted to just block it out, here's where we were talking about that it's adjustable, right? So if you want to make it lower, if you want to make it higher, uh, you can customize it to fit whatever it is that you want and make things disappear. A lot of us have kind of unsightly, as I said before, garbage. I mean, I, mean, I have a garbage area. It's where do you put your garbage can? You have to, right. You, know? you don't want it in your garage. No, and I sure as heck don't want to have to run it 100 yards behind my property and have to take that out twice a week. So what's nice is if you need to conceal any of that um, you can do it hey orange the one that I have here is the most popular um, the one that lovely Rebecca has is in the uh, is yellow. little yellow accents but we also have it in the purple which is Love the one the that's purple. up front so I mean and I, I just I can't get over how it's a lot bigger than the one last year. It is, right? almost double the size, almost double the size. And look how simple it was with the zip tie. I mean, this is a gorgeous mailbox, but if you really do not have a pretty mailbox, yeah. look at how it just covers it right up. So there's the mailbox. Yeah. Now there's no mailbox. Now there's no, hey, listen, um, uh, Aaron, can, do we have our, still have our credit card offer? I know a lot of people might be like, oh, I don't know, 30 bucks. Well, if you got 19, 19, 16, you, you, maybe you'll do it. It's $10 off with a brand new HSN credit card, which you can use for all your gardening things or anything throughout the day. Um, simply uh, go to hsn.com or, uh, or just give us a call if you'd like, and we'll hook you up with that. So if you're joining us late, call the privacy fence. So a lot of times you live in an apartment or whatever, and there's just a hideous, like, a chain link fence out front. If you want to make that go away or if you want to make the cars driving by your driveway at least uh, physically uh, disappear from your eyesight, you can do that. If you've got a wood, old wooden fence and you're worried about things crawling under it or the dog getting out, you can affix this and you cannot get through it. I mean, little things will get through, but not like your, your pets and stuff like that. Maybe you want to use it as like a trellis or maybe you want to use it to, you know, to, to make uh, ivy. You can do all that and it easily affixes to any surface, right? Um, you can use, uh, there's a variety of things that you can get at the hardware store that'll help you. And we also give oh, you just, twist ties. If uh, you honestly, I have mine them. with yeah. just, an, uh, uh, just a nail. That's it. But even we're talking about things to hide, like AC units, chip stucco, oh, this faded is the paint. Best idea ever. But if you have a pergola, it's going to give you instant shade, and it's beautiful. It's, it's my favorite. Stunning, and you're never having to water that. You're never having to get up there and trim it back. Well, and and you know what this company did, which is they made it look so real. Yeah. Because if it was, and, and here's what I'll tell you, because I, I on my little jogging route, I go through this uh, this neighborhood that's about a mile from my house, and this guy built this beautiful home, very very expensive home, but he had a white fence between him and his, his neighbor and he put the most hideous artificial looking shrubbery oh. it's like a mat totally that he covered. brings down the curb appeal like it that just, it, you know what it, it's like when so like what i don't what it makes me crazy or some people like to put astroturf which is fine for some you know if, if you can't take care of your lawn but but if it's really cheap astroturf it looks it like looks a cheap. really cheap astroturf this looks like the real deal and it's made of real 
Um, what'd you call it? Real willow. Willow twigs. And then we've got this full, beautiful ivy that for the very first time we have the color. Each leaf has been pre-treated so it won't become sun-drenched. It's never going to become faded. They can last. All you have to do to clean them ever, if they get dusty or dirty, is low pressure water and air dry but you're never gonna have to water them. You're never gonna have to trim them back. It's Ivy takes over your house and can do so much damage. Never gonna have to worry about this whatsoever. Yeah. Uh, whether it's chips, deco, paint, AC units, trash Look cans. Look at how hideous that fence, fence is. It's ugly. Well, that's like- And you need it. That's like a, a fence so nobody can get out. That makes me feel like very, very <laughs> contained. Now watch, <laughs> now it's softened up by just adding our little privacy fence. Look how nice that is. It's only 29.16. It's already event price for our show. So if you wanna get it, you're gonna absolutely love it. Rebecca, great job. I'm just going to disappear. All right, don't go anywhere. We save the ultimate power tool. Going to get your large yard looking great. Stick <laughs> around. up and you're looking to impress your friends, let me show you how to make this beautiful seafood broil using my DuraPan. Let's do seafood for the dinner party. I'm about to set up. goat milk because we had it and that's how our company started but what we learned over the years is how beneficial goat milk is not only for the skin but for your body goat milk adds moisture to your skin it's really the most amazing ingredient people really do notice the hydration of their skin the farm to skin difference only with Beekman 1802 Look, let me, let me look, reveal. Here I am, everybody. Welcome back to Gardening with Guy. Uh, excited to be here with you, our show. We've got our last item in the hour. We saved something really special for you. And this uh, essentially is the ultimate multi-tool out there. You know, a lot of us have never owned a chainsaw before. Um, and I'll tell you, the reason is most chainsaws are very daunting. They're large, you have to put gas in them, you have to pull start them, they're a nightmare. This is an electric chainsaw, the easiest chainsaw you will ever use. And it's sized down so that people like you can use this and people like me. I, I uh, offer these and get I'm amazed at how many ladies buy this chainsaw so they can trim, uh, trim up their branches and prune their trees and do it the right way. Um, but you're not just getting a, a chainsaw today, you're also getting uh, a hedge trimmer. What you basically have is you have the power of a chainsaw that switches, the actual control switches uh, and attaches to the hedge trimmer. So now you're literally getting two tools for $119.95. Never been easier to use. Um, it's uh, all electric, so it's not only good for you and makes life easier, um, it's good for the environment, so it's not giving off any fumes. They're super quiet. There's no maintenance on them. You don't have to sit there and pump them full of gas and you don't have to try to start them like that. They're fantastic. Um, I've told people forever, do not be afraid of power tools. If you buy the right tool and one that's sized for you, not this big industrial thing, you're not a landscaper, you just want to do some landscaping, then this is what you want. Uh, it's only $119.95, brand new, first time we've offered it, and Peter Kilcullen is here. Hey, guys. What's up, sweet Pete? How you doing? Dude, I, you know, last, last time I was here, you had a pole saw. We love right, our pole right. saws. I own one. Having a chainsaw is the greatest thing of all time because you'll be amazed at how many things you can do with it from preparing firewood to, to clearing branches 
branches and doing all that stuff. Today, we have a chainsaw that also will become a hedge trimmer. Exactly, two yeah. in one. And I always like when we're out here and we can talk about something being two in one. Yeah. And maybe a hedge trimmer is that tool that maybe you've forgotten and you're wondering why those hedges and all those bushes are out of control. Or maybe you're thinking, I'd like to have a chainsaw, but I really need a hedge trimmer. Right. Well, now you don't have to think about that anymore. Earthwise has thought of everything. It's electric, so we're not gonna have to talk about gas. We're not gonna have to talk about, you know, trying to pull start any of those tools. This is your hedge trimmer, super easy, it's so comfortable to use and they thought of all the safety features as well. So let me show you a little bit. We'll just get this working and we'll just see, you know, if your hedges and those bushes are, you know, they're just getting out of control and you want to be able to shape them. You want to be able to keep them looking nice. A lot of us like those hedges in between the neighbors. Yeah. I'm sure your neighbors have the huge hedges in between your oh, house yeah, yeah, and theirs. Yeah. Yes. Keep you out. Well, they try to block right. me they out, try. but I'm, I'm, but it's, I'm a force it's nice to be reckoned to have those with. hedges, but be able to use this to control those hedges, have them yeah. looking good. But then combined with the hedges, you're going to have low hanging limbs, yeah. things like that. You're going to want to put together some of the trees that you take down for firewood well, and cut it. You yeah, have the there's things off. a hedge trimmer won't go through. You know, when you get bigger well, sure. than about a, a half inch in diameter, then you got to go to the chainsaw, but you have both. And you will use this to prune your trees. You will use this uh, when you've got branches that are overhanging your property, or maybe they're hanging over your driveway and you want to cut those down with the chainsaw, you're able to do that. Right. What I love, Pete, about this, first of all, Earthwise is such a great company. It's a green company. Uh, you know, they make products that don't give off any fumes and exhaust. Exactly. And not only that, but if, if you buy... Uh, power tools that need gas are really for professional landscape people. I mean, Most realistically. Times, you know, I think years ago, maybe that wasn't even true, that the electric just couldn't live up to what you wanted, yeah. even your regular home use. But now, we, get, we have these electric tools. They yeah. have plenty of power. They can do exactly what you want. My, so I agree with my that. My neighbor's landscape guy uses an electric trimmer. Why He's not? like, why not? I plug it in. It's so easy. I don't have to worry about the motor failing. No combustion, no combustible engine. Here it is when it's a chainsaw. And I will tell you, I would buy it first as a chainsaw saw because I think that's the greatest tool ever invented <laughs> to not have to actually saw something by hand. Sure. It makes life so easy. And, and talk to everybody about the, how the chainsaw is made because this is the same kind of bar and chain they use on the big exactly, models. Yeah. Let's, let's go over here. We can show both of them together. Okay. So you're exactly right. 10 inch bar and chain, Oregon bar and chain. Again, that's the industry standard. We have an automatic oiling system. So you don't have to worry about manually oiling that bar and chain. We just keep oil in that reservoir. You can get that bar and chain oil anywhere. It's super simple and it automatically takes care of that. We have a toolless way. You don't have to do anything to keep that chain tension exactly where we want it. But both of these are electric and easy to use. Both of them have great safety features. Now I'll just go quickly back to the head trimmer because this is basically what you're getting. Yeah. A head trimmer and that chainsaw. For your head trimmer, we've got 18 inches on that cutting blades that move back and forth. And this will go up to five eighths of an inch in thickness. So exactly like what you're saying, when you get any larger than that, then you might want to start thinking about using your chainsaw. Or if you have to remove hedges, you can take them down yeah. and then really go underneath and take care of them with the, the chainsaw. These are things you normally are paying somebody three or four hundred dollars right. to come for two hours and do. Why not buy this tool for 119 and be able to do it whenever you want? Not only that, hedges keep growing all year. They grow all oh, summer, yeah. right? All summer. I mean, you got to do that over and over. I do my hedges probably every two and a half weeks. I've got to keep. I got to do them. I use the chainsaw at least once or twice a month. Sure. Even more now because of the, uh, because of the rough winter and people have branches and stuff hanging over their property. Right. So right now, this is the time where we're go we're going to have that explosive growth. But maybe from the winter time, you have dead limbs, down limbs, chainsaw. But now you have some dead limbs and you have some things you want to prune back with the head trimmer, you can do that as well. Then the growth happens, you use them again in the spring, late summer, and then certainly as you go into fall, you wanna take everything back both the hedges and those limbs so they're not close to the house because we're going to another winter. The snow and rain causes them to get, you know, way down too close to the cars and the windows and the roof. These are the tools to do it. Guy, let me do this real quick. I'll give you the head trimmer. That's the head trimmer part. So we'll give a quick demonstration so you can see how easy and how well this works. Then I've got to show them how you can go back and forth between your yeah, we'll show chainsaw them how to switch it out. and your head trimmer easy. in about 10 seconds, okay. which is fantastic. So again, 10 inch bar and chain. I don't know, maybe we have like a three inch limb right there. But so smooth, so easy to use. You're gonna love using that. You know what? I, you know what I notice about this? You know, I, I don't have a tight grip on that. I'm not no. struggling with it. There's almost no vibration 
or I shouldn't say there's no kickback. There's no, you know, feeling of being out of control. It's always so smooth. Right. And for someone who's never used a chainsaw, I think that's super important. You are going to be able to do this. So you're using this to cut those limbs, but now you're looking at those hedges and they're getting a little uh, out of control. <coughs> so what we're gonna do here is our snap and lock technology. Watch this, I lift this up. This pulls apart. So there's my chainsaw, I'll leave that right there. Mm -hmm. And then I'll, I'll grab, grab this. This, uh, this is amazing technology. This snaps together and you can see that snaps up automatically. You push it down and listen to this. Now we're ahead. So, cool. so, I mean, you really will be doing that. It can go back and forth in about 10 seconds. And as we're doing it, again, I want to talk about some of the safety features. Check this out with the hedge trimmer. I'm going to flip it around for you. So we have the trigger right there, which if I pull, nothing happens. And then we have the safety switch right there. So I have to pull the safety switch. Wait a minute. Still nothing happens. Here's what they thought of, guy. I have to have two hands on this at all times. Safety switch, trigger, and squeeze that. If I let go yeah. with either hand, this is going to stop. So you are always in control. If anything happens and you feel out of control and you let go with either hand, it's going to stop. So I love that about the safety I, part well, of Well, I think that's what people's fear is. They, they think, when they think of these tools, they think of the one that the landscaper uses. They're different. You're using one that's electric powered, which means you have power on demand. It doesn't stay running once you've started. You know with a chainsaw? It sits right. there, it stays on even afterwards. Sure. Um, I, I mean, if it, the, the bottom line here is that you want something that's easy to use, something that's not intimidating, that's what both these are and I love your point about the hedge trimmer because you know you've got blades that are going back and forth you want to make sure your hands are protected this has that incorporated not just a guard but you can't use it unless you're squeezing the guard and keeping your fingers away from the blades so if you are looking for a way to clean up your property you know what I call this easy spring cleaning that's what this is there no. it is, right there. Easy spring cleaning. Yeah, you <laughs> like that. Yeah, I want to make sure you I, got I didn't one know you too. had that. Yeah, I got that too. It Pete. is nice. I mean, and these are tools, I, you said earlier, you're going to use them all the time. You're going to use them over and over again. You want to have that really nice look. If you want to square off those hedges perfectly, you can do it. If you want to round off those bushes that you yeah. have in front or the side of the house, you're going to be able to do it. So and easy. And then you're going to have a chainsaw that's going to be perfect. Maybe you want to spend this spring and summer and putting that firewood together for the winter time when we get back to that, you're gonna be able to do it. A 10 inch bar and chain. So, so many jobs that you can do with this and they're all easy. And the best part is there's gonna be no gas to deal with and there's gonna be no issue starting these tools. They're gonna to start every single yeah. time. All you're doing with just all of our Earthwise items is add your extension cord and you're ready to go. And you're gonna feel great. That's the most important thing. You've talked about it before. Whether you're a big, strong guy, whether you're a small, a little more petite lady, you can use these tools. It doesn't matter, I, everybody can use I them. I get more phone calls. And like even today, we had, I think we had eight or nine people on Facebook and seven of them were ladies. <laughs> because the ladies, you know, they're like, listen, I, I want, we want tools that we can all use. Use, okay, right. just because you may be smaller in stature doesn't mean you shouldn't be able to cut down a, a tree or a branch or be able to prune your own hedges. A lot of us are empty nesters. A lot of us live alone, and all we have is that we have to call somebody, and then we got to wait three weeks before they make an appointment to come out. I want to do the chore when it when I need to do it. I mean, I don't want to wait two months while that big branch is hanging over my driveway, getting ready to fall on my car. I want to get out there with a chainsaw. And I want to be able to take care of it now. I don't want to have to call somebody and have them come every month to trim my hedges when I can do it myself. Maybe I'm having a big party and I'm having a get together and I want to clean up the property. Having both these tools, and remember, you get both. Right. This is not, normally we do a chainsaw for, you know, 120 bucks or a hedge trimmer for 49 or 59 or 69. You're getting both, so it doesn't take up a lot of space. The power, the motor powers both exactly. tools. Um, and you just saw, Peter, how quickly he switched that out again. Watch. It's, it's Look, incredible. You open it. You open lift that, you pull done. it apart, and then you add either your hedge trimmer yeah. or your chainsaw push it together, you lock, lock that in, in place, and you're ready to go. You know, I, I get excited. When you get this home, you are gonna be really pleasantly surprised because it is going to be as easy as we're saying. And you've never used a chainsaw, you're gonna think, wait, I waited all this Not time hard. thinking that it was gonna be intimidating, no. difficult, and it really isn't. I'll, I'll do a couple more cuts, guys, well, I think, real I quick. Think what is it, what's intimidating 
is having to go to the gas station and fill a gas tank and pouring gas into it. And then you have to prime the pump and then you got to, uh, you know, you got to pull the, the, the uh, you know, the pull cord to get it. That's what's intimidating. Right. The blade itself is that big. It's perfect for home use. You can oh, have yeah. branches that are about that big. So that usually is great for everybody. Peter, great job. Thanks, Thank guy. you so much. I know we got great kinda, to be here. not a lot of time, but I'm glad we have a lot of people that grabbed it. Hey, by the way, our, uh, our um, privacy fence is still available if you want to get it. I wanted to mention that one last time. You can turn that into that in seconds. Isn't that beautiful? $29.16. Remember, it comes in three colors. It comes with the yellow accent, it comes with the green accent, and it comes with the purple accent. So uh, anyway, I'm so glad that you joined me, everybody. Thanks for being here with Gardening with Guy. Remember, you can join me uh, every Saturday at 8 a.m. Eastern time, and you can, remember, gardening's supposed to be fun. It's not supposed to be hard. If, you're, if it's hard, you're doing it wrong. Sit back, relax, and enjoy gardening with Guy. Hey, enjoy Beekman. They're coming up next. The Beekman boys will be here with the lovely Callie. Uh, anyway, enjoy your day, and I'll see you next time, everybody. I'm just gonna relax here. <sighs> our first product was soap, and Bath & Body is some of the favorite of our neighbors. Every single Bath & Body product we make is packed with goat milk. And the foundation of every beauty regimen has to start with the way you cleanse your skin. 